Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel today. I'm super happy to have this mermaid hack doll. She's Mari and I know that they are uh, officially discontinued but I decided to get her. I also got um, Ciara and Finley and I already have a review for Oceana on my channel and that video actually has a lot of views so that's pretty nice. <laughs> but yeah, I decided to finally get them. I actually had to wait for them to have like free shipping for my country so yeah that's why I'm um, just reviewing them now but yeah here we have her um, there you can see the box of course we already saw these dolls like all over uh, Instagram and stuff because again they're already like dead <laughs> like this is uh, discontinued line so yeah that's pretty sad here we have the artwork some bubbles right there here on the corner it says two in one play and we have them like the mermaid to like human form and it says removable tail here on the front it has the mermaid high logo the packaging is really really pretty actually and you can watch the um, the webisodes on the YouTube kids app here on the back we have again the mermaid high logo splashing for fashion and we have the four characters here on the side and here on this beautiful artwork which i think it's really really nicely made i think like um the concept art was made by darko dark but the final version was like drawn by somebody else but it's still a really really nice one and here we have like some kind of little text so you can totally pause and read that if you want to and here on the side it says that shell opens in water for a little surprise inside and here on the side we have the artwork of Mari as a mermaid which is really really beautiful so now i guess we're just going to open her up and um talk about why they decided to discontinue this line. Okay, so I'm finally back and here she is out of the box. I have to say that I don't consider this box to be that hard to open. Like I've heard a lot of people complain about that. It was kind of easy actually, so yeah but maybe that's because uh, she has been in the box for a lot of time so maybe the glue of the like the cardboard backing was kind of dry yeah that's my theory but yeah here we have the doll i am using this monster high stand to um balance her while i'm making this review but we're going to start with her accessories first we have these glasses which are a really nice mold as you can see there on the center we have a little octopus then we have the purple lenses with some like weird shape there on the top which i think it's really cool then we have the um, sides so there is like some kind of tentacle wrapped around the side of the glasses which i think is a really really nice detail um for like the the doll like the theme that she has <laughs> so she comes with this comb which looks like a little shell and we have these shoes which are purple we have some uh like scales on the platforms and the heels and we have some like buckles there on the sides uh, they're like a rubber material we have this skirt which is like pleather and we have some uh, printing here and it's like some tentacles some little safety pins right there it's really really nice and on this side we have this material which is like uh, some kind of uh, woven material I don't know how to explain it but it's a really cool detail that they decided to add this little piece of uh, a different fabric and then we have the little shell which I'm going to open in a moment so yeah oh and she also came with this purse which is black and there you can see like the skeleton of a mermaid so yeah again really cool details and the handle looks like a octopus tentacle so pretty awesome then we have the doll so she has beautiful eyes they are really light blue and she has a little bit of purple eyeshadow so she has purple eyebrows as you can see they're a little bit darker than her hair 
um, she has bangs as you can see and she has really full eyelashes I really like that she has hot pink lipstick and a really nice face mold um, I would say the first thing I have to um, point out about these faces is that they look kind of weird like as you can see here on the light that is reflecting on the eye there's like some kind of lines right there like like the eyes were printed so yeah that's kind of weird um but yeah she has a really nice face sculpt and uh the hair is incredibly soft really 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 nice quality um i do have to say that it is not as full as i would like so if you move it just a little bit you can totally see the scalp right there so yeah the, the rows are not as full as they um should be i would say um then we have this headband which are two uh, tentacles they're purple and they're sewn onto the hair and uh, again a really nice detail um uh, really on brand with the doll then she has this choker right here which is silver and it has this little star charm she has this top which is uh like a pleather kind of material and it is blue with some printed black lines on top and bottom of the pleather piece then we have the like the chest piece which is in mesh and then we have this like little ribbons that go over the shoulders as you can see and they have little silver dots so i would say they look like studs or something like that then we have this bracelet right here uh it looks like three but it is just one the good thing is that uh it is all painted so that's cool we have some black paint and some pink paint to separate the little uh, bracelets and uh, yeah that's basically it as you can see she is articulated at the elbows but not at the wrists and also at the shoulders and at the head but she just moves it from side to side then we have the tail so she is a really nice looking goth mermaid so she has this chain right here which has a octopus right there looks really really cool we have a lot of chains like coming from that same like piece right there and they are this part right here is sewn to the tail as you can see right there and also the octopus it is sewn right here but of course you can undo the chain right here and also the tail has velcro on the back then we have the fabric of the tail which is like this um like shimmery kind of fabric we have some uh purple tones and some blue ones we have some black lines and some scales yeah it has a lot of uh things going on but it looks really really cool then we have the fin which is incredible in my opinion of course we have this material which is like the 80s kind of material used for mermaids and yeah some other like doll dresses so that's kind of cool then we have two more layers underneath we have i think there's two or three something like that but yeah we have this one which is like a purple kind of tool no this one is tool here the black one and this one is like a some kind of I don't know mesh or something like that like yeah organza or something but yeah it is really really full like it is a really big tail so i really love that they went all out with the fin and um yeah she also has articulation on the legs and at the knees but that's as far as they can bend so they can actually sit down pretty well but um yeah the knees don't bend as much so in general i think it's a really really nice looking mermaid doll um i think the full price is not really worth it because um yeah you know how <laughs> they went they were not selling that well and they were like on sale for five dollars which is really crazy uh, i actually got them on sale but it was not that cheap for me at least and um yeah that's it for the mermaid form of this doll now i'm going to change her into her human form so that we can uh check that out oh by the way uh she also came with this little plastic bag we have the instructions the little id card and her little fishnet stocking so let's just open that up really quickly so we have the little stockings they are just black we have the little id so you can totally pause and read that if you want to 
and here's a look at the back we can have the artwork of the four dolls and we have the instructions which are okay i guess so here we have the human look and as you can see she can kind of stand on her own with the platforms because they are pretty big and um yeah she is looking really really cute there you can see how the skirt looks on her it is kind of short but really cute <laughs> and we have the stockings and the shoes so yeah a really really pretty doll now uh what i'm going to do is uh reveal the little surprise on the shell so i have this um water right here and we have the little shell so i guess i'm going to move the camera and i'm going to drop this right here so let's see if that makes something let's hope it does yeah no Okay, so the water has to be warm, so I didn't knew that, but um, I guess we're just going to try opening that up just like so. Oh yeah, there you can see it is a mess. <laughs> so we have this shell right here, which is supposed to be like, a, I don't know, some kind of laptop or something like that. So here you can see how that looks. It is like all silver. We have the screen right there looks really cool and we have like the keyboard right there and of course you can close that back up and there's the little button so that you can open it again if you want to and here we have the little surprise which i'm pretty sure uh, are the earrings so again we already knew what was on these bags because this doll is kind of old but yeah here we have the earrings which are this shark teeth so yeah they're black and they're look really, really cute so let me put those on the doll so that we can end this video so here we have the earrings on the doll they are kind of hard to put on because the poles are a little bit too big for the earring holes but yeah here we have them on her she is a really really pretty doll um she is not as detailed as for example like the mermaid's mermaid doll because at least the ones from the winter line are like totally packed with accessories and stuff so but um i think they kind of had some more future than what they lasted i think uh all the little details for them to be cancelled were basically the company not being like confident enough of uh the designs of their team so yeah that's pretty sad that they are no longer in production they had some really cool dolls in the way and actually this is the only mari doll that we we're going to get so that's pretty sad as well and um yeah i don't know what else to say other than um rest in peace memory hi <laughs> um i'm really curious to know what do you think about this doll if you have some of them maybe you got a bunch of them because they were five dollars or you just decided to get the ones from this um first series or the ones from the summer break or something like that summer yeah the ones from the like the swimsuit line <laughs> those are really really pretty as well i love 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 sierra in that uh set but i don't have her just yet <laughs> um but yeah that's basically it thank you so so much for watching don't forget to like subscribe comment down below and um follow me on my instagram my tiktok those links will be in the description box down below and yeah i'll see you in the next one bye